Islanders and welcome to today's video in which we are going to be looking at rounding off decimals. Okay, so so far we've looked at our rounding off rules, we've looked at rounding off whole numbers, but what if we have a number like this? Say 2,37195. Now, usually when you round off with decimals, um, the rules are going to be very similar. You're still going to look at the next door neighbor on the right to determine whether the rounding value stays the same or goes up. So we still abide by the rules of 0 to 4. It remains the same. However, 5 to 9, it's going to go up. When it comes to decimals, they will usually tell you how many decimals they wanted rounded off to. In this case, you can see we've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So what if they say to us they wanted rounded off to three decimal places. So we've got one, two, three. That's all they want to see. So what's going to happen? Do we look at this column over here? No, we don't. We look at the neighbor. This one over here. Look at our rules. Is it between five and nine? Yes, which means this number goes up. Therefore, it's 2.372. Have I rounded it? Yes. Have I rounded it to three decimal places? Yes, I have. Okay, let's look at another one. What if I take that same number and I want it rounded off to two decimal places? I go back to my number 2.37 so they only want it up until there I look to my neighbor what do we see there the first rule applies it's between 0 and 4 which means it stays the same which means my answer will be 2 comma 3 7 right and again that's the rule we apply when it comes to rounding off with decimals